Hello and good morning, everybody. It is... Well, the date of the recording is June 5th, 2015. Uh, this video will probably post tomorrow because my internet is being god-awful today for some reason. I can't do anything online. Reset my router tons of times, and it's still just not being happy with me today. Um, anyway, this is my June 2015 kind of channel update. Is what I almost forgot what I call them. Uh, my channel update, along with um, some just what I what I would like, what I'm excited for for E3 because E3 is literally. Um, the week after next. Yeah, week after next. This was Sunday, I guess I But today is Friday. So, a um, couple things to point out. I know I've not been posting as much as I have, but obsessed with doing other stuff. Um, I'm hoping to be moved at the end of this month or sooner. Providing uh, money is an obstacle to get over always for me. But I'm, I'm hoping uh, that that works out and me and my kids will have a lot more room for me and my family. My wife and my kids will all have kind of a lot more room to uh, be ourselves in a way and also um, let us have better internet because I will have Comcast internet, which is more reliable. And even though everybody in the world hates them, including me and myself, kind of, uh, I'll have better upload speed so I can upload videos faster and I can actually do a lot. So, um, I haven't finalized a date yet, but later, later this month or very early next month, um, I will be doing a live stream and hopefully you guys will look forward to that because it'll be exciting. It'll be my first live stream. I'm going to have, um, several of my friends over at different times. Um, I got some stuff planned in my head, but got it all on the paper yet. Um, so we're sitting at 116 subscribers right now. Um, I did a couple little stupid videos about Amiibos. One of them took off really rapidly for some reason, but whatever. Um, and I know, so I know that my Resident Evil videos are really not getting a lot of views. Uh, so I will probably stay away from those types of games, I think. Uh, even though I really enjoy playing them and making the videos for them, uh, you know, they sit for two weeks, two, three weeks, and maybe get like four views and then they stop getting views. Uh, I think pretty much just a couple of close friends at work are actually only watching those videos. Um, unlike, I just recorded an episode of Tetrabot and Co. that I'm going to possibly try to post tomorrow at the same time this video posts. Um, and that I know got some more some more views than than anything else did. Um, so I'm I'm gonna finish the two Resident Evil games, uh, but I probably won't start playing Dino Crisis like I was thinking about doing. Um, I might end up just playing that myself, just because that was a fun game, which will give me more time to enjoy. Because then I'll just run through it, and be awesome with it. Um, what else gonna talk about? There's not a whole lot to talk about. I don't think besides moving into some of the E3 stuff. So I'm gonna I'm gonna change my um, edit my scene again here. Whoa, I'm supposed to shrink myself first. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, there we go. That's good enough. So um, IGN.com has the the list of all the press conferences. So if you're wondering where to actually watch some of the E3 press conferences and what time they are, blah blah blah, uh, you're probably not. But if you were. IGN.com has the whole listing and links to um, where they're going to be streamed on uh, on Twitch. So I requested some days off from work. I requested the 14th through the 16th off so I can watch all these because I will be doing a uh, uh, not necessarily a reaction video, but a I don't know what else to call it, a reaction video. So after the video ends, I'm going to create a video comment on what I saw what I liked, what I didn't like, what I thought was missing, um, all that kind of cool stuff. Um, cut my head off here. Uh, but for right now, uh, I'm going to kind of go through and list what I think might be shown or what I'm excited to be shown. So the first year ever, uh, Bethesda has decided to do 
press conference. And as soon as we saw they were doing a press conference, we we were all pretty sure, dear God, they're going to finally announce Fallout 4. Um, but they actually just announced Fallout 4 a few days ago, so it's totally official. All the rumors were true about timing of it, location of it, all that good stuff. Um, I'm not going to go into that a lot because I kind of covered that in my trailer reaction video. If you haven't seen that, uh, please go watch it because I... I got a little emotional over watching that trailer because uh, I'm super excited for that game. So with Bethesda, I am super, super excited to see a lot of Fallout 4. Um, like just actual real gameplay, what they're going to be adding new into the game, what keeping uh, with the same theme of the game. I mean, through the trailer, it looked... That's Fallout. That's Fallout. Man. It's freaking awesome. Um... Uh, so I'm just super excited to actually see some real gameplay, maybe some new mechanics, how everything's going to work, um, what they're tweaking, what they're adding into the game, all that great stuff. Um, Bethesda obviously are, makes other great games too, so um, uh, I am forgetting the name of the game right now, and I'm ashamed of myself. Um, but it would really be cool if, um, what I'd really like to see from Bethesda, maybe they would release a new IP, that would be super awesome if they release something brand new um, but I have a feeling most of their press conference is going to be just Fallout 4 which I'm okay with I'm okay with uh, so Microsoft um, I'm not really a big you know Microsoft fan at all you know I'm not an Xbox fan I'm more Playstation uh, that kind of thing um, but I feel like we're going to well, I'm definitely going to see more Halo. Halo 5's coming out. Probably a lot of the new first-person shooters that are by some of the other companies that are out there. Uh, it'd be really ridiculous if Microsoft announced, like, a handheld game. But I feel like handheld gaming... Start, like... Sony's not doing too great at it. Like, I could care less about the PlayStation Vita. Or whatever the heck it is. Like, handheld gaming pretty much belongs to Nintendo. And I think it's always going to be that way. Um, EA, uh, it'd be really cool if they release some new IPs. I, I really want to see more new IPs, because that's what I, I mean, new IPs are, are fantastic. Like, you know, sequels and other stuff are really great too, but I think new IPs are probably my favorite. Um, we're going to see some older stuff. I'd probably like to see maybe, maybe something with a new Dead Space. I didn't even play the latest one, but, um... I was a huge fan of Dead Space. Maybe another game similar to Dead Space. Something new. I don't know. Ubisoft. We're probably just going to see Assassin's Creed and Rayman. Who knows? Uh, yeah, I've heard some poor things about some of the last Assassin's Creed games. I haven't played... The last one I played... The last newest one I haven't played is uh, Black Flag. So I need to play Black Flag and play all the other ones through it. Hopefully they don't release too many new IPs. Um, Sony, I feel like Sony is going to announce, uh, they're going to have, Microsoft probably too, but Sony as well are probably going to have a lot of Metal Gear Solid 5 stuff. Um, I'm hoping to see more on that. I'm really hoping they announce that really sweet maroon PS4 um, for the States because Metal Gear Solid 5 comes out in September and that limited edition PS4 is basically only in Japan right now, which makes me sad. Um, and that's what I'm kind of planning on buying a PS4 is in September for Metal Gear Solid 5. Because I bought my PS3 for Metal Gear Solid 4. But I figured, why not? Let's just do uh, the same thing. Um, I feel like Sony's going to announce some new stuff. Uh, I feel like they'll probably do a price drop or something on PS3 or PS4, I mean, which would be cool. Um, they're probably going to announce some more networking stuff with their PlayStation Now and different things like that. Uh, so Nintendo, uh, God, I really, even though they've already said no, that it's not going to be there, I'd really love to see some new information on the new Zelda. That would be really awesome, the Wii U version of Zelda. We're probably not going to see that. Um, there is rumors that a new Star Fox is going to come out for the Wii U. That would be pretty awesome. Uh, I'd really like to see Nintendo kind of move towards more of a traditional control style instead of like all the pads and the motion controls and all that other stuff like 
I mean, some games it's fun, but some games you're just like, man, I just wished I had that Pro Controller, because they should have just included that in the Wii U bundle, but now I have to pay 50 bucks for it. Uh, for some reason, I feel like we're, because there's been rumors of a new actual hardware from Nintendo. I would really doubt we're ever going to see anything, probably for the next couple years, but that'd be interesting to see, see that. Um, Square Enix, they're probably, so there's going to be some Final Fantasy XIV. Because the new expansion's coming out. Uh, so they're probably going to talk about that. Sony might talk about that as well since it's on the console. And I don't know what else. Um, more Tomb Raider and more Final Fantasy XV possibly coming from Sony and Square Enix. I mean, I'd like to see more Final Fantasy XV. Maybe some more summons. Uh, gosh, like, like I said, I'm really bad at doing predictions and things I want. Um, I know a lot of people for Sony are wanting to see... The Last Guardian, which you guys are just hoping for, but I, you know that game's probably dead. Um, a PC gaming show, I think that's something uh, just IGN does on their own. Be quiet, kitty. Stupid cat. Um, but I think I guess that's uh that's about it. I don't have too much more to talk about. Super excited for E3. Look forward to some videos after each press conference. Um, that being said, I don't think I'm going to get the 15th and the 16th off uh, from work. So I'm going to watch those videos later. And then my, my video would be posted later. So... Probably going to be old news. Which is really disappointing to me. I tried really hard to get those days off. But some stuff came up with another supervisor, I think. Anyway... Thank you guys so much for watching, and until the next video, be kind to each other. I'll see you guys next time. Bye bye. So I am I'm a complete douche because I started um, I started recording like 15 minutes like at the 15 minute mark, and I thought I was doing some pretty funny stuff uh, to add into the video.